what I'm about to demonstrate is something altogether different. Again, this is specific to a totally different user interface, one that I think will play out big time in the future. Um, but again, it's a matter of getting information back, but in the easiest way. And you can imagine that this would be uh, great in a conference room, especially where you have board members and others present that don't necessarily want to query the database or use even something as, as simple as what you could do with dashboards in, in Argos. Alexa, open a Visions Assistant. Hello, Hilbert College. How can I assist you? What are the total number of students enrolled in fall 2011? There were 1,117 students enrolled in fall 2011. How many new students in undergraduate programs are enrolled in fall 2013? There were 303 new undergraduate students enrolled in fall 2013. What are the total number of undergraduate students enrolled in 2016? There were 1,659 undergraduate students enrolled in 2016. What's the 10-year total of enrolled undergraduate students? There were 19,061 undergraduate students enrolled from spring 2009 to spring 2019. How many Asian students are enrolled in fall 2016? There were eight Asian students enrolled in fall 2016. What is the total number of students that were enrolled in spring 2019 by ethnicity? There were 43 Hispanic, 22 American Native, 8 Asian, 48 African American, 2 Native Hawaiian, and 550 white students enrolled in spring 2019. Alexa, stop. Goodbye. So I've got it mention um, that last request that uh, that I made, it had to do with uh, the way the data warehouse is set up. Um, when we originally did this, we, we just became operational in the last week or so. But it was built originally on a selection from fall 2008 through fall 2018. And I've been working with this fellow at Avisions, his name is Travis, great guy. Um, I asked him yesterday, I said, so what would happen if I populated the data warehouse with the current term? And he said, well, should work, give it a try. Um, so I did that. Um, and then I got busy with some other things. Roughly about 40 minutes after doing that population, I um, uh, one of my assistants came in, noticed the echo dot on my desk, and he said, well, what's that all about? And I said, well, let's give it a try. So I called out that last request that you heard, and sure enough, it was there within 40 minutes. And to me, that was pretty impressive. And as a matter of fact, when I did the 10-year count, it did it on the latest term backwards, which maybe is even is a little bit more impressive um, at least to me. But in any event, um, I've got to say that this, to me, is a, it, it is a game changer. I mean, it, it, it's something that simplifies things for the non-technical user. And I think it plays uh, potentially a very big part in the future. And I know this is just the beginning of what um, might be capable with the product. And I know they have some thoughts in mind about taking this um, way beyond what, what I've already demoed.